So the black people were claiming oppression or something like that. And, um, and they showed off their pictures of black people that were whipped. And it was the same five or 34 people. Black people whipped the shit out of like five or six black people, basically. Five or six black people got the shit whipped out of them. And then they just reproduced the photographs and had the people stand in different poses and different ways and stuff like that. And said, look at all the black people that are oppressed, blah, blah, they whipped us, they beat us, they kill us. Freedom, blah, 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 revolt. And it's the same black. And then the scientists went over the pictures and said, they matched all the scars and they said, these are the same pictures of the same people over and over and over and over and over again. Over 100 or 300 pictures are saying that it's the same five people in different poses and stuff like that. The, the, the Chinese, though, had thousands of people that really got whipped or something like that. Or whatever. And were shot in the head and killed. Or something like that. I don't know. One of the groups, basically one of the groups claiming oppression or whatever. And, and the black people were like, that, that's, that's right, fool, we fooled you. You know, whatever to me or whatever. I was like, no, you didn't really fool me. You fooled someone. Anyway, yeah. So the black people, well, I mean, they're still at it in, in Africa. Oppression, we're being oppressed. Yeah, whatever. Still claiming that they're rich or whatever. Still don't have any kind of birth control or whatever. Basically, they're free, all right. They're free, and like I said, mostly the black people, they kill each other, they rape each other, they do all kinds of horrible things to each other. Because there is no black leadership. Other than, burn it down, a plague into this world. So they just, they don't teach their children, they don't teach anything, and they just run around like they own the place and basically just lie and pretend. That's why their daddies did it. So anyway. So anyway, so the black people are constantly becoming a problem, and basically mostly the black people of Africa with the guns just lure intelligent white, intelligent black people over there and then grab them and force them to do things or get intelligent people to think that blah, 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 or something like that. I don't know. They've basically been living on a lie this entire, their entire existence. Oppression by the Germans. Oppressed. We were oppressed by the Germans. We were oppressed by the French. We were oppressed. No one oppressed the black people. No one. Black people always had equality, always had freedom, always had laws, and always had and always had blah blah. At least until they basically started oppressing everyone else. And mostly rape. So anyway, yeah. So that little secret's gonna come out eventually, or it did come out actually. That the black people were always the oppressors. And blah, blah, and think that they can control the world and control the universe, and they can't and didn't. And realistically, the black people took care of the, took care of the problem themselves because they were tired of getting shot and raped. Or will take care of it at some point in time. And straighten out. And it's just a few, few black people with third grade or first grade or no education at all and could barely even speak and couldn't read at all. Other than they can pull a trigger. The Germans had a problem with them, the French had a problem with them, and realistically, the problem was is that they kept on doing human wave tactics. The black people just do human wave tactics. No strategy, no nothing, just run at the guns! And like I said, this is very interesting because I had the, um, the my, uh, what's called, uh, the Palestine, or palace, what, uh, one of my palaces was being built, I believe it was the, um, one of my palaces was being built, and I had two Gatling guns there because I had a fair amount of gold there as well. And the black people did a wave tactic attack on two Gatlings, thinking it was like machine guns or something. They'll have to reload in a minute or something. Anyway, there were two or four Gatlings at this one place, and yeah, 3,000 black people or more died, and they kept on running at the guns. And the guns just kept firing. So, and then the black people took pictures of it and said, look what they did, they slaughtered us. Of course. The black people is one of those groups that, no matter what, you're oppressing them. Even if, even if you get them in the throat while they're trying to rape you. 
It was oppression. So, constantly in their entire existence, claiming victimhood that they never, they were the one victimizing people. So, I don't really know. I don't really care. But anyone that says anything bad about the black people, whatever, or blah, 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 usually gets killed or shot or something like that. And basically, it's just a couple of black people that should be dead by now, I believe. And leave the rest of existence holding the bag of how bad and how horrible they really are and were. And how despicable and discredited and just disgusting they were. Like I said, they had no medical and they had and they had so many parasites within them that they were giving parasites to other women when they were raping them. So they would rape the French women and then, or the English women, and then the French women would go in and get and ask. The, and the Germans would be like, "Do you want which parasite do you want to kill? One parasite or two parasites? One parasite we can do something about, <laughs> or the second parasite in your stomach, <laughs> or would you like to kill both parasites?" The Germans and the English had the first drug would kill both parasites very easily. The problem, like I say, was killing the one parasite in your ass without killing the parasite in your stomach. That was the black person's child that after he raped you. Which we did. Germany and England, we got the drugs that will only kill the parasite in your ass and not the one in your stomach. Given to you by the nice little happy black rapist. Like I say, the reason why the black people wanted to be black and the white, the reason why they're black is because they wanted to be able to blend in in the dark. Dark boys. They thought they could take over the world. It only lasted a couple of years, and, and, the, and the Germans had the night vision the whole time, so it really wasn't of any real significance. So, anyway. Like I say, there are a lot of problems. Mostly by people who didn't have a real education. So. Finally, at some point in time, I basically sunk my teeth into them and said, Look, if you don't stop, I will torture you. And I will never have created you. So, like I said... And realistically, there might, I might not have created them once. I'm not exactly sure. Like I said, their hair turns white for a reason. And even then, they're like, we are white. See our hair? We are white, people. Just another lie. I turned their hair white. Well, I was wondering. I had some of them working for me. So, anyway, I don't know. I don't care. Like, it's just so bad. You know, I mean, if I wasn't your creator, and many a times I was like, I regret ever creating them. I wish I hadn't. I wish I hadn't created, like, I wish I would have just stopped at the 1.5s. But oh well, whatever. You created. And you're in existence now. Mazel tov. Like, I mean, I mean, I love, I love the Irishmen, the Irish people. And I love the Germans. And I loved many groups. And the blacks had time, chance after chance after chance to straighten up and be, be good. I don't think they ever choose to. I don't know. What they do is they use their slave mines or whatever and they get gold and then they support one or two people in society. And then they come contact these people in society and they say, okay, we've supported you, now you got to do something for us. And that's what basically Africa does.
they put people they put people through school to drag them back to Africa or drag them somewhere to try and whatever 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 like I say basically a guy with no education or a first grade education or street smarts was basically running their their whole society like I said he killed his council he killed he even had a black council educated black council that was very smart he killed them too then he started killing other people thinking that yeah, he's deadly, whatever, and then that he's tried to rule through fear. So, then Africa or some place was was basically going after him to kill him. And that might be the guy in in Korea. Like Africa wanted him dead. He was going to kill him. His own black people wanted him dead, so he ran to Korea, where he could not, where he could be mildly safe. And he asked Korea for amnesty. This is why I stopped offering amnesty to people because like you know they were just people that were going around killing one state or one country and then they would just run from that country trying to get into another country or something like that and then they would do the same bad things in that country or something I don't know like, I don't care like I mean I'm just like God will know the truth. You mean the government authorized delusion and the government of defense project, or do you mean Lucifer Star, your actual creator? For which you are trying to kill and have, have been trying to kill for 50, 500 billion years. And, and the most you could get was making me a Brian. Anyway, the truth, the truth will set you free. Not really. <sighs> like I say, I don't, not prejudice against black people. I think Eddie Murphy did actually maybe turn his life around, maybe. Although he was probably faring on drugs or something like that. I don't know. Poor Eddie Murphy. I think he did, might have listened to his daughter, though. I don't know. I don't know. He's not a bad person. He's just... They're all just confused. Everyone's just confused. If you understand why everything was happening, why it all is, maybe that'll help. I don't know. There's nowhere to go. There's nothing to do. There's 300 or 3,000 other humanoid planets. There used to be a travel system to go between planets and place, and you had faster than light travel. Probably still do somewhere out there. There's some whatever. I'd say you need to work it out among yourselves. China's got it though. If the black people, like I said, the black people were trying to take over China, and for a while there, black people in kimonos, by the way. Very interesting, by the way. There's a bunch of black people running around China in kimonos trying to be the Chinese consul. <laughs> like I said, the funny thing is the workers, the people who are the inventors and the workers and the groups who actually worked the hardest actually did the best. The slaves actually did better than, than the people just trying to shoot their way through. So like I say, that's why the Chinese actually did really well is because they're being forced to do all the work. They're being forced to do all the labor. They're being forced to do all the all the all the all the inventing and all of the science and all of the th this and all of that. So they knew what they were doing and they knew how to do things. So eventually they did better than the groups that were just trying to shoot their way along. The uh, the Irish did a did a combination of both of shooting and well mostly 
production and then they started getting shot or something. Someone attacked my Belfast, basically. Probably part of the Black Wave or I don't know. Yeah, anyway, I don't know. Like I say, if you're Irish, I'm sorry. You are awesome. You did work. You're not just people holding guns. You're good people. So. Anyway, I make these videos as a telling of basically your history. I'm more than a record book, of course, or more than a log book. I'm your actual creator. And the only reason why I survived the time war was because I'm your creator. And there wasn't anything you could do about it. I had to exist. I had to do everything. And everyone else is dead or gone. Or run to some other planet for which they thought more technology was there. And there probably is more technology. The whole universe has more technology than Earth. Mostly because they thought, well, he's going to use Earth to blah, 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 climb the power, blah, blah, blah. It's like, no. I'm 90 trillion years old. I ain't doing no climbing. I'm just kind of like, wow. A bunch of people telling me when I was younger, you don't know what we're doing, we're blah, 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 blah starting to trip over each other so anyway and generally overpopulating and starving overpopulating and starving overpopulating and starving shooting other people for resources shooting other people for housing shooting other people for cars shooting other people for guns shooting other people for aircraft raping killing raping killing. Like I said, the funny thing is when you had less technology in the world, you actually did better. When it was just cavemen or whatever, or just low technology levels, you actually were doing really well. You actually did the best as 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 low level, low technology groups or life forms. When you got into technology, that's when you started running into problems. Like a black man says, I'm a thinker. I'm a thinker. I think we smart black people. Actually, I think it was I think it was Papa that was like, our black, our black boys are smart. They're thinkers. They're real thinkers. They're real smart. They'll, they'll, they're going to come for me, blah, blah. Or they're going to get you, blah, blah, blah. And it's like, he was talking to me, and I was like, <sighs> everybody else is like, who is this guy? Blah, blah, blah. It's like, Name Booster Star doesn't ring a bell. Booster Star line. Like, I'm not responsible for the people you called your leaders. I'm not responsible for the black people. Like I said, for some reason, the black people didn't feel a white person could lead them or should lead them. So they had their own black council and. their own leaders you know like I said the funny thing is it was just Lucifer White Star Line that they saw because my name was Lucifer White Star Line they considered me enemy my name was originally Star and then it was Lucifer Star Line then I had the white so yeah and I haven't actually been a person until now. Like I said, I was going to be Lucifer before. He was a star line, but that didn't work out. I was grabbed by him, something or other, blah, blah, blah. So I never lived that life or something like that. Or it's a life I would have lived, but didn't live or something like that. So. So the world knew a Lucifer. That was like their best bet, was basically to, 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 to replace me or to uh, live... Because the Lucifer identity, you know, I had a lot of money and a lot of everything already set up in the counters, already set up. All I had to do was be born. So anyway, so someone else took my place as Lucifer Star, but he wasn't really Lucifer Star or anything. More than a person that had access to a bank account. And a name and an identity. So anyway...
So the first life I ever lived as Lucifer Starline was basically Brian. The actual Lucifer Starline. First human life, anyway. In, a, in one of the bodies that I created. Or created life form body. So this is the first time and the only time you know, you're going to know me or knew me. So anyway, but as my other existences, as a computer and basically creator, I lived for hundreds of trillions of billions of years. 90, 90 trillion years old. With a small gap between Brian when he's a child and later on. Anyway, I don't know about it, you know, there's all kinds of fabricated history, fabricated lies, Christ's cup, they had the DNA of the Creator, someone, there were 3,000, and all it was was a gold cup with some jewels around it. And the rest of them had been pilfered or melted down, and they only had one left. And they used that one to put DNA that was, I guess, JFK or Jimmy Carter or something. That would be the... I don't know. Grass the Vatican. Well, humanity people, well, humans actually practice a lot of free will, a lot of free choice, mostly to their own detriment, and a lot of freedom of speech, and a lot of freedom of belief, mostly to their detriment. Um, you know, I was just an inventor, a leader, and creator, and someone just having fun with one of my companies, and basically doing some epic ships with, um, with some Irish people, some other people, so... Anyway, my companies and my ships still got built and everything. They still needed me, still needed my company, still needed my direction. All the leadership was basically just me. They're kind of listening to me every now and then. All planning to kill me in the end. Or at least some. So anyway, not understanding that I was actually 90 trillion years old or... 50 trillion years old. Creator of the first stars and life forms and all this other stuff. And very much didn't really care. I was just living my vacation as a child for the first time ever. For which I was going to be Lucifer Star and spend some money and see my planet. Maybe go see some of my other planets. I don't really know. I said I had been checking on particle creation and doing all this other stuff for so long, and I started to make some nice places. Because I could. I decided I could do more than just check on particle creation. I could actually do other stuff. So I did. So I made some habitable worlds, put some life forms on them, then created some more life forms, made some more habitable worlds, blah, blah, blah. What else was I going to do with all the billions and millions of years? Wander around some more? Anyway, so all those women that slept with Lucifer Star really just slept with some person lying. I've only slept with a couple of women. So. And most people in the universe had were of no real consequence or substance. The Japanese or, or Asians are way more powerful. And the Germans were pretty powerful, but that was mostly because I was powerful and they were just kind of taking over my stuff or something like that. For which, I guess, someone, some other group stopped them or something, I don't know. Even the Germans said a lot of stuff was theirs, but it wasn't really theirs. It was all exoskeleton technology or something else like that, I don't really know. I don't really care. Just a bunch of lies. A bunch of people just running around saying they own the place. They tried to say Adolf Hitler owned Germany. He's the fourth Adolf Hitler, and really for the longest time they were doing mustache rule. So I don't really care. 